Hey, what's up, everyone? How's it going? You doing good? All right, uh, that's that's excellent. Anyway, I got a delayed release day unboxing. So now release day unboxing. It's a day late, but whatever. Uh, for Dragon's Dogma 2, of course, I'm a big Dragon's Dogma 1 fan, especially Dark Arisen. Couldn't wait for a sequel. They announced it a couple years ago. It's freaking here. Uh, I was supposed to get this yesterday, just didn't have the time. And then <sighs> I thought I pre ordered it for Xbox. I guess I didn't because they gave me a PS5 copy. I was like, oh. So I, already, I, I spent like two, three hours making a, a character in a main pawn. And now I'm going to have to do it again because I did it for the, the the little like demo they released for your character creator. I'm assuming that can't transition to PS5 if I did it for Xbox. I am only assuming because that would make sense. Um, so I'm going to have to do that again. But uh, anyway, so yeah, I got a copy of Dragon's Dogma 2. Uh, I was like, you know what? That's fine because I'm a PS5 collector mainly at this point. So you know what? Whatever. I wanted to get for Xbox because I had so many games to play on PS5. And I was still considering getting Rise of the Ronin, but... Once they pulled this out, I was like, you know what? No, I'm just not even going to get Rise of the Ronin. Because then I'll have like <laughs> like three or four PS5 games to play. And that'll be my entire hard drive, by the way. Um, but anyway, I still need to finish Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, which is excellent so far. And now I'm hearing great things about this. As long as you, you, you're not one of those people that are just like, yeah, it's microtransactions. It's the worst game ever. It's the worst game ever. It sucks. Okay, I'm sorry. But most of the microtransactions you just get in the game. There's so many videos saying, yeah, uh, you know that thing you were bitching and moaning about? Uh, 30 minutes into the game, you can just get one. You know? So I don't know what the fuck to complain about. It's just people wanting to complain about a game because they probably had no hype for this game at all or they just love to fucking complain or they have to make videos about every game is bad now. I got to make a video. Oh, Dragon's Dogma 2 is, is, is terrible. Like, I understand the PC version is bad, but you know how many fucking videos... I've watched already that I'm just like, oh my God, that th they're like, oh, the fucking microtransactions, oh. like, shut up. Anyway, so <laughs> who gives a shit? Really? They, it's not like they're taking parts of the game away from me. They're not. They're not. Okay. I don't hear all this fucking shit about like when there's a new Madden game or a FIFA game or whatever that's nickel and diming you for fucking cards, F digital cards that won't even matter in a year after their next fucking four out of ten game comes out oh they charge you 70 bucks too madden being 70 bucks and this being 70 bucks you know how many people I've, I've seen say like dragon double three should be 70 bucks to go to your michael transaction shut up what the fuck you talking about madden every madden game comes out and they look like dog shit they look like they're games that should have came out in the early days of the xbox one and they're still charging 70 bucks and sure people are complaining about it too but i've heard nothing but fucking bitching and moaning about this fucking game for the last like 24 hours it's it's ridiculous like shut up like really stop god i've i've kept silent about it for the last 24 hours but everywhere i go transactions. it makes me all pissy and sad anyway so drake i understand if this pc port sucks yeah that i get i'm talking about just the people that were complaining bitching and moaning about the microtransactions i just realized i don't have a freaking knife uh can this work? Here, I got like a little piece of metal thing here. Let's see. It worked. Don't even need a knife. Don't even need a knife. You know what's funny? That's a... It's a key from Resident Evil. And I unlocked my package. There you go. I should be showing this, by the way. Does anybody actually give a shit about the, the actual unwrapping part? It's not unwrapping, it's unboxing. This is the box, watch this. Here's the front cover, which has awesome artwork, by the way. Love the artwork. Look at that. So good. Got cat ladies, got lady ladies. Wait, that's a lady, right? Yeah. And then you got you. Big ass heart. Gone. Your fat heart gone. And here's the back. Look at that. Even the back's good. Look at this. Spine. Fucking premium spine. Look how good that spine looks. God damn. You know, I love Final Fantasy, but like here. Let me see it. Where, where is it? Where, where's, the, where's the fucking case at? I don't know where it is. But the cases for fucking Square Enix games are just always like white backgrounds with generic text. This, boom, look at that. Immediately got identified. You don't even need to read the name. You look at it, you go, oh, that's the Dragon's Dogma font. I can tell. Anyway, there's the back again. Uh, <laughs> and then uh, that's it. All right, well. <laughs> How do you do, fellow neighbors? There's the disc. That's all you get. No background. 
Let's just talk about how good the artwork was, and then you kind of butt fuck me there. Uh, you are the chosen one who shall slay the dragon and claim the throne. Didn't say anything about the fucking dragon eating your heart. Set forth on your grand adventure, Arisen. Adventure alongside pawns. Blah, blah, blah. Deeply detailed, immersive fantasy world awaits. Challenge your creativity in diverse combat against fable monsters. There you go. I mean, that's pretty much all the selling features of the original game. I, that's what I kept hearing. This game is just like, <laughs> it's just the original except better. Sounds good to me. Anyway, so there you go. That's that. And uh, there you go. So that was like more of a rant than a fucking than an unboxing, but whatever. Again, I totally understand if most of your complaints are the PC port sucks. Totally get that. That's not what I'm saying. I'm talking about the people... I've heard way more about the fucking stupid microtransactions. Like, people immediately freaking out. You can't even fucking fast travel while giving money? Like, that's why people that... I, I, didn't Metacritic allow you... Oh my god, no, not Metacritic. Wasn't there a site where, like, you actually had to play the game before you even talk about it or something like that? I, I could have sworn, like, you had to actually play it. I guess it's Steam, right? Steam, you have to actually play it, right? Before you get to... Or at least own it before you even, like, review it or something like that, Right? I'm pretty sure. That's why every place needs that. Because you have no idea. Or at least do some research. Like, come on. Oh, don't you have to pay? You don't have to pay anything. You don't even need to look at the fucking microtransactions. There's so many games of microtransactions. Sorry, this is actually a good fucking game. If it's the same as Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. I mean, yeah, Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. Then I can confidently say this game's going to be great. Because I fucking love that game. And if it's just a better version of that. Oh, fuck. I'm ready. <laughs> Sold. Anyway, that's it. We're done. Fuck you. I'm just kidding. I love you.